Hey, it's Jennifer Rizzi with the Daily News, and I'm standing here outside the Arclight Theater on the Upper West Side, and I'm about to take you behind the scenes of Bed Bugs, a brand new musical. Now, the show couldn't come at a more opportune time since just last month there were more than 20 bed bug sightings on the subway system. This show takes the topic to a whole new level. Come with me and check it out. Bed bugs in this show don't look anything like real bed bugs. It's really, we just kind of went crazy sci-fi with it, um, you know, arachnophobia, or any, any sort of creature or insect that you can take and then make, bring to the lar a larger level. You make it big or you make it, you know, rampant or you make them alien or whatever. And we're sort of just taking that premise and doing that with the most, you know, the thing that we're plagued right now with in New York City. The way bed bugs spreads is someone sees something in the garbage, he goes, ooh, a mattress, takes it into their home, a chair, and that's how bed bugs spread. So we incorporated that very strongly into our design. I'm sure you can see there are piles of garbage all around me, and giant dirty mattresses. Our props, our set, even our costumes are built out of garbage. Like when we were doing the first run of bed bugs, I would wake up in the middle of the night slapping myself, you know, like thinking I had bed bugs all over me or something, like I just got bed. I just got bed. Something's, something's in my bed. The, the theater is bed bug free as far as small bed bugs, but our large bed bugs are quite something to uh, contend with, I, I will say. And they're sexy. Bed bugs are sexy. But it is very funny, and uh, the audiences that we've had so far have just laughed from beginning to end, and that with the score is what we're hoping will keep them coming back for more bites of bed bugs. For more information, you can visit bedbugsmusical.com. Reporting for the Daily News, I'm Jennifer Rizzi.